Hey, so I am in La Jolla today. Um, they kind of just gave us a car and I get to explore the area. So yesterday I talked about the new 2018 Hyundai Sonata, which was great. We, um, we got a chance to drive around. I really enjoyed the car. It was great handling. Um, super roomy everything like that I'll tell you more later once I kind of get my thoughts together on that and everything else and because Hyundai's motto is to make things better we did a lot of things in helping in the community donating to the animal shelter donating to the local children's hospital paying it forward when we went through the drive through at Starbucks so it was pretty cool I enjoyed it but it was a long day oh and then we finished it out with a paint night and of course we yeah painted some Hyundai Sonatas and then um, we had dinner watching the sunset so today we are actually going to we're in the I see I'm speaking in royal we I'm so used to having a partner or being with my family or something so if I break into like the royal we just yeah please excuse me so today I am in the 2018 Elantra GT and I have to check my paperwork. I believe I am in the sport edition. So this is their hatchback, which is awesome. I think I first test drove the GT back in, I mean, let's say 2014. So there have been a lot of updates. Again, super roomy. I will show you, there's some great trim. I love how they have everything set up in here. But right now I'm actually just parked in downtown La Jolla then afterwards I'm going to get out explore a few different places I think not too far from here is a place called Children's Pool Beach where they have some sea lions on the shore so they're always fun to watch so if you can take a look around look at this in this hatchback it has this panoramic sunroof how awesome is that I love that because it always makes it feel so much more roomy and it has a bunch of other features in here it has the um, dual climate, it has, oh, I have to look at my paper with all of the stuff that it has in here because I'm like just drawing a blade. But let me turn it around and I'll just show you the inside of the car. Let's see, there we go, okay. So, let's see, a nice design. And then the dash. So you have the eight inch navigation screen in here with um, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto dual climate control hey friends and in here you have the USB and also under these chargers sorry I'm in park down in here it's not focusing too much on there and the lighting oh there it is it's a key charger so if you have an Android you have that wireless charging, that little cubby hole. You have the electronic brake, auto hold, so it kind of turns the car off while you are stopped. There's a cup holder here. Look at this. I love these action accents. See, it's kind of like this metallic red color. It's really cool. I like that. And then it has the 6040 split seat look at that that's a nice amount of room nice right and then i will get out and show you more later let me see how busy it is here okay well, i can get out and show you a bit of the car now i have the car running because it's getting a little hot so let me turn off the air conditioning and turn off the car Okay, let me turn it, walk around the car so you can see it. And I'm gonna grab my little handy dandy Wi Fi just in case so I don't lose you. Okay, let me get out of the car really quick. Unlock it. Okay. Try not to get run over. That would be a bit of a liability for the company. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to flip it around again so you can see the outside of the car, okay? And there we go. So I wanted to get kind of like the electric blue color that they have, but someone already took it, of course. And I already love the red, but you know, we own the Hyundai Tucson in red, so I wanted to do something different. So I just have the dark gray, which 
served us well in this Sonata yesterday. So it's a, it's a sleek look. You have LEDs with optional for the headlights as well as the fog lights. So that is really nice. I have to walk around this plant. Excuse that. Okay, that has lines going from the front to the back. They were talking about how it has like this nice satin chrome trim all the way around the window. So it gives it a nice flare. And we have this unlike the Sonata, which had that really cool kind of hidden button here for the trunk release. On the Elantra GT, yes, it is the Sport. It's here. So let's see. Let me check to make sure I have nothing embarrassing in the trunk. <laughs> so it's got, it's really roomy. There's a ton of space. Of course, you can take off this ex this cover and there's a ton of room. Actually, let me do that. I'll show you how much room there is in the trunk. Let's see, hold on. This is never easy to do with just one hand. And let's see, there's a release. There we go. Okay, so you see how much space there is? And then if I pop down these seats, See, there's a release right there and then a release right here and just pop that down so it's a lot of room in a compact hatchback oh I have to go grab that later my arms aren't long enough to go reach it on my own so as you can see the Elantra GT the 2018 model is really nice so if you're looking to get a fun sporty car that is functional has all the safety features you can get the um you can get the front alert you have a backup camera with the rear cross traffic it also has a driver attention alert so if it notices you're starting to drive a little erratically it'll let you know there's blind spot monitoring i mean this this thing is loaded and it comes in a 2.0 liter or a 1.6 turbo giving you a lot of power and oomph when you'd like it so yeah it's a pretty cool car but i will talk with you soon <sighs> recycling trucks they always come at the most inopportune time so i will talk with you soon i'm going to explore the area a little bit i guess the rest of the group is probably wondering where i am you know, some people drove with a partner, but then I was going to drive with someone else, but then they're like, hey, we have an extra car. Do you want to just take your own car? So I'm like, okay. So that's kind of cool. So that means I get to talk with you guys today since I'm by my lonesome. So I get to chat with you a little bit more. Sometimes when I'm with people, I have to be all social and get to know them and everything. And I feel it's kind of rude to be on my phone talking to someone else. You know what I mean? So anywho. I will chat with you guys a little bit later once I figure out where I'm going and I don't scare all the locals as I'm, they're wondering what I'm doing. Although it was kind of funny, I saw a gal here earlier taking pictures. She was all dressed up and she had her photographer and I felt kind of bad because I pulled up and then they actually had to move but they're a little further on because now a car was in their picture. So, but yeah, okay. I'll talk with you later. Let me know since I'm exploring La Jolla. I've never really taken the time to drive around here. Let me know if there are any places that you think I should stop by, places that maybe um, are just cool to see that I can take nice pictures. If you have any suggestions, if you've been here before, if you're local, please message me either on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, whatever, and let me know if you have any suggestions, any favorite places. Okay, I will talk with you soon. Bye. Oh, and don't forget, today I'm going using the hashtag ElantraGT, so make sure to follow that, and I'll be updating my stories as I go and everything. So, okay, have a good day, and I will talk with you later. Bye.